Are 6 core CPUs really enough for gaming these days, or do you need at least 8? So today's games typically rely more on single core speed than core count. This means a modern 6 core CPU like the Ryzen 5 7600 still holds up incredibly well, even in demanding titles. In head to head FPS comparisons, these chips generally trail their 8 core counterparts by just a few percentage points. For most of us, that small gap isn't worth the extra cash, which could be put to better use elsewhere. Even if you're running an extreme GPU such as the RTX 4090, a 6 core CPU won't bottleneck it to the point of ruining your experience. As long as your hardware supports upscaling technologies like Nvidia's DLSS, or AMD FSR, you'll enjoy smooth frame rates well above 60 FPS in practically all games. If your primary goal is a 60 plus FPS experience, going beyond 6 cores isn't really necessary. Of course, enough can be very subjective. Certain games, especially large scale simulators or strategy titles like Civilization VI or Microsoft Flight Simulator, need to utilize every last bit of CPU power they can get. For those titles, having extra cores can help boost both your average FPS and your 1% lows, resulting in a smoother overall gaming experience. Competitive esports players who chase high frame rates at 1080p may also see marginal improvements from 8 core or even 12 core processors, particularly in CPU bound games. Also, some fairly recent games like Cyberpunk 2077 can hit high CPU utilization across all 8 cores. As developers continue optimizing for multiple threads, you're only going to get more out of an 8 core CPU. So, if you have the cash to spend and want a game at high resolutions with top of the line graphics card, or you simply want to future proof your rig, 8 cores might be worth it. Choosing between 6 and 8 cores will often boil down to how much you're willing to spend and how soon you plan to upgrade again. If you're building a new PC on a budget, you'll likely get more bang for your buck by going with a capable 6 core CPU and spending the extra money on a quicker GPU. But if you're building a high end system, pairing an 8 core CPU with a premium GPU can give you a small but meaningful performance bump in certain games, especially if you're into big RTS or simulation titles. Plus, you get that added headroom for future titles that may rely more heavily on multiple threads. Let me know in the comments which CPU is going to be in your next build.